Yeah, so I'm so long-winded that I actually had to do this in two sections. So this is a continuation. This is part two of uh, my last video. So sorry I had to do it that way, but, you know, I'm, like I said, I don't edit this shit. I'm just some guy talking. So anyway, continuance. Uh, my parents ultimately decide, okay, we're not going to take him back in. We're not going to tell them that he's stolen this stuff because they were scared that if they turned me in, then I was going to catch a larceny charge or I was going to get arrested. And then they were, and I didn't have a job at this point. I was 15 years old, you know, so they, it would have ended up costing them money, you know, a court date, possibly community service, all these things, you know, criminal record. I mean, they're looking at all these things. And I remember sitting in the parking lot at that mall for probably 10, 15 minutes, my parents talking this out, sitting there trying to figure out how to proceed with this. So ultimately, they decided not to, to take me back inside. Uh, we drove back to the house. And at that point, I'm not 100% sure exactly what they ended up doing with the garments. All I know is they did not let me keep them. <laughs> so, um, yeah, so my parents ended up, um, ended up not turning me in, taking me back to the house and I never saw those clothes again. And, uh, my mom took them and they, I guess, put them in her closet or something like that. And I don't know what she ended up doing with them. Uh, they probably just held on to them or, or threw them away or, you know, ripped the tags off and gave them to Goodwill or something. I don't know what they ended up doing, but I know they didn't take them back to the store. But, um, so that's an example of another one of my crazy Klonopin stories. Man, Klonopin will make you do some crazy shit, especially if you take too much of it. So, uh, that's just another story from my, uh, drug diary there. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, let me know if you've ever had any crazy stories on something like Klonopin or some other sort of drug that kind of takes you out of your mind and caused you to do something that wasn't typical for you because I want to hear about it. So anyway, appreciate you guys like the video, leave a comment down below, and uh, please do subscribe to the channel. This is Corey, out. Peace.